Before starting the animation, we'll take a look at a set of thumbnails that will give us an idea of what to expect from this project. So here we have them, just basic ideas as to what each character should do in our, our scene. If you haven't got into creating thumbnails before animating, I'd highly recommend that you consider it because it can help you save a ton of time. And I'm not only just talking about storyboards, storyboards do help tremendously of course, but personal thumbnails also play a key role in, in helping you to work faster. Because at that point you can go ahead and kind of sketch in quickly what you'd like your character to do, that way when you get into your 3D package, you have the direction there and you can get right to work. Alright, so what we see here, based off of these images, is that our villainess will strike first and the heroine will then counter attack knocking the villainous down. So let's go ahead and keep this in mind and we'll also keep this with us if we ever need to use it as a guide. And in the following lesson what we will do is take a look at our control rig so we can just become comfortable or familiar with it before jumping right into our performance.